week's guest doesn't seem to have arrived. It appears that he may have had a little difficulty completing his fantasy. Mind you, I'm not in the least surprised, considering that uh, his fantasy was being chased around Smithfield Meat Market by a man with a meat cleaver <laughs> while wearing a pantomime cow suit doing a Greek dance. Well, he made it. What a delightful piece of nonsense that was, wasn't it? He made it, but I still haven't the faintest idea who's underneath that. So, um, so would you reveal yourself? Oh, yes. There we go. Oh, Graham Chapman. <laughs> good morning. 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 morning, sir. And welcome. How are you? I'm fine. It seemed like a good idea at the time. It was a wonderful <laughs> idea. <laughs> Hot in here. Idea, but mm. it, whatever possessed you to, to come up with a fantasy like that? Why did you want to be a pantomime cow? Well, uh, actually, it's... I've been the rear end of a horse before, pantomimetic horse, but, but never, <laughs> never the front end, and uh, a cow was available. Most of the horses were out for pantomimes, of course. Of course. Yeah. And uh, there was no yak. No, and you wanted to, you, that was actually your real fancy. You wanted the to be a yak. Yes, I couldn't ride well, that. Would have preferred a yak. Yeah. Yes. What extra dimension did being chased by a butcher with a meat cleaver actually add to the experience? Yes. <laughs> um, adrenaline? It did, yes, adrenaline, I think, <laughs> is the answer to that, yes. yes. A little bit of speed, yes, yes. certainly. Mm. It gave it a little bit of excitement for you. Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You didn't actually see a shot that, uh, one thing that did happen is the, the, uh, the, the rear end of the horse was leapt upon by, by one, of the, one of the meat porters. It was a real kind of situation at one point. Well, it coped very well, the rear end of the horse, I must say. Yeah. You all, I was also terribly impressed by the way in which you actually manipulated the eyes and, and, and the ears. I mean, obviously, a, a long theatrical training is necessary for that kind of uh, activity. Qu oh, quite a bit, yeah. yes, yes. It's, it's a complex sort of art. How, how does one do it? I mean, can you reveal a pantom, a theatre secret? How do you actually yes, do yes, that? There you are. Or is there some sort of... Inside, there's all these... Um, uh, yes, yes. have all these... You have to pull strings, as it were. Strings to pull, and then things happen. Yeah. Yeah. 
What sort of reception did the, did the horse get? I mean, we didn't hear any... The cow. Uh, too much. Uh, the cow, yeah. sorry. So that was, yeah. Uh, we didn't hear too much of uh, the Smithfield reaction, perhaps as well, no. actually, in the circumstances. Yeah, well, it was more or less along the lines of... Wait, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. That yeah. sort of thing. Yes. Yeah. 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 The comments they meant it, such as they? that. Yeah. Oh, they meant every yeah. word of it. Yeah. Yeah. Where did you actually um, have the uh, distinction of being uh, the back end of a pantomime horse, and how did that come about? Well, that, that was on, a, on a, an early python show, mm -hmm. uh, in which there was a pantomime horse being James Bond, you remember? <laughs> Sorry. He's being a, a sort of <laughs> pantomimetic James Bond. I see, uh, yes, mm, yes. Mm. Mm. Uh, what, one thing that still puzzles me, of course, is who, who was, if you'll forgive the phrase, the other half. Um, <laughs> any, any, yeah. any offers on that? I, well, mean, I, think, uh, I think I may be able to answer that one, because I think uh, there's going to be a bit more from the action. Really? Which should reveal it all. Just oh, have a look at this. I wonder who it was. It was terribly good. Clears it up. Yeah. TVAM, please. And all because Wincy failed the audition. Um, I'm tempted to say you found your vocation, yes, then, but... Yes, uh, absolutely. It's a peak of my yeah, sort of uh, yeah. journalistic life, actually. <laughs> and I must say, you look a lot better this morning than you did when I was doing that, Graham. Oh, thank you. Mm, I didn't know your face um, at all. Without, <laughs> without, wishing to, without wishing to get too detailed about this, I mean, what's the atmosphere like in there? Uh, Ooh. It's warm, isn't it? Yes. Warm is Very, good. very warm. Yeah. Mm. You develop a particularly sort of um, close relationship. Don't yes, you? I can got imagine. You. It's not yeah. easy to hear each other. And certainly, I must remember, <laughs> can I just mention this, that um, the, the guy with the, the meat cleaver running yes. about, he ought to, we ought to say thank you to Ivor. Ivor. I have a, I have I have a meat cleaver. Ivor. I have a meat yeah, cleaver, yes. It's yes. terrific. Yes. And also, the guy who lent him the cleaver, yes. I think he ought to get a special mention, that's De Joe Deadman. Terrific. Who's an Arsenal Let's supporter. Yeah. Oh, well. <laughs> Hence the name. Without, um, without whom none, none of this uh, historic television would have been possible. Correct, yeah. <laughs> yes. That's right, wasn't it? It's quite an experience. It certainly was, yes. Yeah. It's an unusual way to meet. Ever been a panto so horse, cow? No, no, so I've, I've got a, a cow in the pantomime. You're not available for two weeks at Torquay. Yes, what's she called? Well, so. <laughs> Daisy, but then you can change her name if you like. You know, I'm over office if you pardon yeah. the expression. <laughs> never done, never got inside it. No, I'm afraid not. It anyway, be. finally, Graham. I mean, I'm many thanks. Do you actually enjoy it? That, that's the most important thing of all. Uh, yes, I did, in retrospect. Yes, I think <laughs> yeah. I think that's the, the one way yeah. one does enjoy pantomime cows. Yeah, I yeah. was the one with the retrospective. Yeah. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> I must confess, it's a bull man that gets inside anything like that with Nick Owen. I must say. <laughs> um, we're going to take a break. Stay with us. <laughs>